Alright YouTube, this is Alex here. I just thought about something real quick. Uh, great shit. Uh, I got a bunch of batteries that are shot completely. Um, using my Porta Cable NICAD uh, for, for my batteries, of course, them are still good. But I have some uh, 18 volt, 2.5 amp hour, which is a really good battery from Rigid. Uh, battery sucked ass. It was at 0, 0.00 volts. So, you know, of course, it's got the little indicator to tell you if the battery's dead, overheated, power issue, battery's charged. Okay. So, this is what I could, my dilemma was. This is from Harbor Freight. It's an AC uh, MIG welder. Will not work. This is a Milwaukee Power Supplies. Not from the company Milwaukee um, Power Tools. Not it. This is Milwaukee Power Supplies. This is a DC uh, powered. I got it set right now uh, with the arc on. I got it at about 5 volt and it runs at 72.6, 72.5 volts DC. Uh, these batteries are completely and utterly dead. They're all 18 volt rigid and I have my rigid right here. In order to trick that thing the battery charger to charge the battery it has to have some voltage or it'll read bad. So this is what I'm going to show you guys. Uh, let me unplug this right here. I'm going to sit right here. Okay. I'm unplugging my power. Okay. Now I'm stuck with zero volts. Alright. Let's see if I can zero volts. Alright. This is the negative, of course, of the battery thing. Alright, so I'm gonna put this on the positive of the battery and I'm gonna put this on the negative. And you see how we're still at zero. Alright. Now I'm about to apply the power back to this and it might get bright and arky but this is amazing love this right now you see we're at 72.45 volts right now we're at about 34 gotta pop it off all right give it a second let it it's uh, basically at 5 amps DC charging force charging this battery so it gets it really hot so you can only do it at intervals do it really quick, do it really quick, pull it off. This battery ain't as damaged as the other one that I just put on charge. Do it again really quick, really quick, really quick. Pop it off. Alright, now we're still at 72.4 volts. I'm going to pop my positive back off. Put my positive lead back on the positive terminal. And put my negative back on. Bam, 20 volts. That's how simple it is. It tricks your charger into giving it a deep charge because the battery charger already knows that it's uh, already sort of dead. You do the uh, quick boost charge about two, three, four times, maybe five times, but you can only do it for a couple of seconds a piece. It tricks your battery. You see how the voltage is dropping from 20.9 to 20.7.6. You do that a couple of times and it'll stay at exactly 20.1 volts for a really long time basically it just energizes the battery again breaks all the calcium takes the memory effect away from it really quick and then you put it on the charger and you're done it works and it charges well tell me rate subscribe and comment and tell me what you think about the uh about my little rig i got going here that's basically all it is all right comment rate subscribe it's from rigid and oh yeah, these are like a dime a dozen at like uh, secondhand stores. Five bucks for this hundred dollar battery. You could save it. Go ahead and do it. <laughs> all right. See y'all later, YouTube.